And I feel like Butterfly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime bro. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy out of the game. Time SP to nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire to fly. We used to rap it like that. Is it on? Is it on? Is it on? Ha ha ha. Son of a itch. Let me get my gun off my hip and get this started. Salute to every single one of y'all out there. Yeah, I got my water for the slaughter, all that. Salute to my guy Showtime SP and every single one of the subscribers. That notification gang, is this thing on? Is this thing on? Okay, it's time to bring it like how I sing it, right? If it's something heat about it, I'm gonna speak about it. That's just the way that it goes. But um, got a couple things I wanna talk about, you know what I'm saying? Um, we gonna recap Chilla Jones versus New Jersey Twerk later. Showtime SP, he ducked me last night. He'll t I just want to let y'all know that he ducked me, but we'll, he'll be back tonight. We'll, we'll, we'll get it done. He's going to call it fake news, but it is what it is. Um, so, oops. Salute to oops. Everything he does personally and professionally, just coming off that Oscar nomination. You know, he won, we won. Even though he did not take home the Oscar, he still won for even being there, putting himself in a position to have battle rap looked at by big eyes by doing his St. Louis Superman, which was a powerful documentary, to even be in the position that he was in was magnificent, you know what I'm saying? A, a black activist being nominated for one of the biggest awards in the world, you know what I'm saying, um, it w w w was big for me. Um, I watched the Oscars, I mean, I seen the, the order that they were being um, presented in, and I made sure that I watched the ones, the, the but three or four before his, I got to see his and I got to see, you know, the winner, um, learning to skateboard in the war zone if you're a girl. The title of that movie alone says Oscar. You're not, you're not beating that. Learning to skate, come on. It, it, it's all politics. But speaking of politics, I'm getting, I'm doing well with these the transitions. My transitions, like, like top, top tier transitions, man. Um, Oops talked about his battle with JC that's not happening. Um, he was supposed to be battling JC on the Rare Breed Entertainment card that was going down in Atlanta on the 29th, but um, URL has Genesis down there the same day. And uh, I had heard rumblings about cards being going down on the same day. And, um, you know, some people are calling it petty. Other people are calling it business. Some people are saying one league had the car. Who knows? I don't know. But as the battles come out, we're going to recap. You know what I'm saying? You know, it is what it is. So... Oops did comment on, he said he knew nothing about the battle, uh, about JC taking a battle with O-Red. He said, this will be my last time speaking on it. JC and I were booked to battle a couple weeks ago at that was the only battle he had for February 29th. Days ago, JC backed out of the battle. Then yesterday, we get a surprise with this. That's the whole story. Um, basically saying that JC has backed out of the battle. URL got the bag to JC, come on home. And JC said, I'm, I'm coming home, I'm coming home. He went back to the crib and now it's looking like JC's battling against O-Red. Now, while JC is battling O-Red, to me that's an interesting battle. We'll break that down, we'll talk about that. You know what I'm saying? When I get with my guy, showtime, I get the humming or something, the humming or something. So that'll be what it is. But um, he, he basically backed out against Oops and um, I know there was rumblings about people saying that JC would do both battles and, and people said that that's never been done. People have done that before. Are you kidding me? There have been people who have battled multiple times in the same day. DNA for one. I know he's battled about four, five, six niggas in the day. I think John John. There's other people who have battled twice in one day. But um, Oops was saying it from the perspective of he didn't want to get whether it would be throwaways or he didn't want to get a half a half performance from JC. He said that's just not what he was interested in. He wanted the full investment. And, um, you know, I think, now that I think of it, um, first of all, I like JC versus uh, O-Red. You know what I'm saying? I got no knock on that. And um, business is business. Money is money. Hustle is hustle. Stupid is stupid. You the dumbest of dummies. Leave me alone. Let me just live my life. But, uh, I do like the battle, you know what I'm saying? I got no invested in any, I don't got no investment. The battle's good, we're gonna talk about it, we're gonna recap it, don't matter what league it's on. That's just me, y'all know how I give it up, so it don't even matter, I don't care. I got no, I got no, no dog in the fight. But when I look at it from Oops' perspective, I think he would have respected it more, cause uh, JC, he, Oops had posted something else about the whole situation. Hold on, let me see if I, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. 
he had said something about uh, him and JC's relationship. He was talking about how, um, you know, it was um, bigger than battle rap, or, you know what I'm saying? JC was saying that he respected Oops and he knew the family or some shit like that. And, you know, Oops had took offense to it, you know what I'm saying? Saying that, you know, me and him had a better situation than just being being a battle, you know what I'm saying? Like, they were saying that they were close, that he respected him, you know what I'm saying? But the thing is about battle rap, uh, battle rap is like niggas is going to eat wherever the money's at. Where the money's at is, is where it is. Okay, here we go. Um, I was just stalling while I was getting this to post for y'all. He said, JC tweeted on January 27th, it different with me and Oops. I met the people that he brought him to tears with him in his battles. His wife, his kids, I know them. This man deserves all he got coming to him, real one. You know, and he said, uh, you know, so that's what he that's what he posted about. Oops posted that, saying that JC said that he respected him on a higher level, but then he just backed out of the battle. And I think that, and the way Oops was kicking it to me, like he, he referred, I said, if he would have told you, Look, this is a situation. I got a bigger situation on the table, but I got three rounds for you. I'm just letting you know if you still want to do it, I'll do it. If not, you know what I'm saying? We could look at this, 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 and this. Oops is saying he found out when the announcement happened. So that's kind of when he was like, I'm not doing it. You know what I mean? And um, I got Oops's um, live stream. I'm going to put it at the end of this so y'all can get his words. Y'all can get his words. You know what I'm saying? Why, why, why should I say what he said? You know what I'm saying? He, 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 he'll get to... Um, Get his own, get his own bars off. I think that's the best way to go about it. But uh, you know, I, it, it all gets crumbled like coffee cake. You know what I'm saying? Gotta take a water break. But uh, ARP said the situation, the the 29th gets darker or whatever the case may be. ARP, let me highlight you for a second. B. He said February 29th has been made darker. That's what he said. That's what he said right here. That's what he said. He said February 29th has been made darker. Listen, my G's, whatever you plan on doing, right, right, whatever you plan on doing, let's get this thing focused so they know this. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you plan on doing or plan on pursuing or however you plan on moving, you might want to make it known ASAP. ASAP. Because one of the better battles on your card just got taken off the card. So now you got 40 Cal versus Ill Will, I guess. Uh... You got Adi Boom versus Big K. I mean, I guess <laughs> Adi Boom's return is what's up, but niggas don't. A lot of people don't really fuck with Big K like that anyway. But I'm just being honest with you. I mean, we ain't got you ain't got like no big name like Cal. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, <laughs> I'm I'm gonna let I'm gonna let it be what it is. I'm gonna let it be what it is. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I, I I'm still uh, A War versus Danny Myers. I'm still fucking with that too. Um. I want to see how this goes, though. I definitely want to see how this goes. Um, salute to everybody out there, the subscribers, that notification game. Follow me on caffeine, Vada underscore fly. I don't know how to use that shit. I don't, I, I don't think I'll be live streaming on that joint because my, my main group of people is on YouTube. The 50, the 40, 40 50,000 subscribers is on YouTube. So that's where I'm going to be at. I don't know how to use that shit. But follow me anyway. It's a trend. It's, it sounds cool, right? I mean, whatever. But uh, salute to the subscribers at Notification Gangs. Salute to my guy, Oops. And you know what I'm saying? He basically got backed out on this battle. Uh, it's just the nature of the beast. I mean, I, I do want to see JC versus um, O-Red again, part two. A lot of people don't even know that they battled before, but they did battle before. Um, that was back when O-Red had the dreads and shit like that. But, uh, you know, salute to the subscribers at Notification Gang. Come out to play, I'm getting out your way. Now, JC! You backed out on my man, it is what it is though, you know. So I guess it's business, right? I guess it's business. Salute to my guy Showtime, you know what I'm saying? He ducked me, I'm not letting him off the hook for that. He did duck me. It counts as a duck. One. About life. Why you gotta stop? You gotta say, look, check this out. What what's really going on? First off, I'm not battling JC. I'ma try to go ahead and do this. 
I'm gonna try to go ahead and do this without getting too too amped, cause ain't nobody got really time for that. Um, shouts out to ARP, shouts out to RBE, shouts out to the home team. Um, this ain't even no. This ain't even no URL RBE. We're going to go back and forth. We're not going to do none of that. Like, I'm really tired of the politics. Um, I'm tired of the politics of battle rap. I'm tired of the pettiness. I'm tired of um, the back and forth um, because, like, anybody that knows me knows somebody. that I'm somebody that always, excuse me, y'all, respected the culture as a whole, right? Even when the politics was in there. Like, even when it was notable, you know, even though there's notable friction that nobody will really speak about between RBE and URL, I still showed up at URL events to um, to support fellow battle rappers, right? I spent my bread, you know what I'm saying? I spent my money, you know what I'm saying? And so now, uh, and that's as a fan, that's as a fan. That's as a fan of the culture. They ain't got nothing to do with nothing else. That's strictly as 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 oops as a fan of battle rap because I am that before anything. And so now, now in the wake of you keep hearing just politics and battle raps and and, and battle raps and this battle ain't happening because of that and that battle rapper ain't happening this and it's all hearsay. Most of it'll be hearsay because nobody knows. Nobody knows. Everybody front like they got the inside scoop. But on every level of this business, people will only tell you what they want you to hear. So all those bloggers, all those fans who feel like they got insight, always understand. Always understand and think about what you're being told. What side of the story is that? And if there's another side, if I'm being too philosophical, don't watch. That's that's just, just period. We we not. I mean, you you gonna sit through and, and and hear me explain and talk from my perspective, or you know, just feel free to log off. It's all good. Um, but at the end of the day, at the end of the day. The politics had like politics has really taken over battle rap, y'all. But the thing is, and war JC can't confirm nothing because it takes two people to battle. It takes two people to confirm that a battle is going down. I am not battling JC. I don't even know why JC came on that stream and said he doing both battles. For one, for one, bro, I'm not, you're not finna, if there was, if there was a chance of you battling two people and I was one of them people, I wouldn't even take that battle. You're not, that, that's not even, that's not even a good move for, for either one of us. That's not a good move for either one of us because you're not finna make me seem like, like some chump, like you're going to three oh me or like you're going to come beat me and go to another, no, nah, you're not finna get, we're not doing that. We supposed to have way more respect for each other. Like just a week ago, two weeks ago, you was on Twitter faithfully talking about how much of a stand up dude I am and how it's always been family and how you met my family before. And, you know, you know, it's bigger than battle rap with us and all of these things like. That's what you said. But then. You back out of our battle, bro. That's what you're not telling the people. You back out of our battle. And if if I don't know who's saying that he going to battle twice, I don't know if JC said it. I don't know if somebody else said it. I don't know. Whatever it is, y'all, whatever it is, it's not happening. It ain't no, 
Oh, I'm not. I was I was preparing to battle JC. That's just what it was. I y'all know me. Y'all know I ain't never duck no smoke. Y'all know I ain't never. That ain't whoever. I always. It don't matter. Even though, even when everybody like, oh, you gonna get smoked. You gonna man, I don't. That ain't me. I know what I'm capable of, and I know what I'm capable of bringing out of those folks who y'all say the best, who y'all feel are the best. I know I'm capable of bringing something out of them that other rappers can't bring out of them because they know they got to come to me a whole different way. So there's no, ain't no backing out for me. I'm, I'm ready, suited and booted. Was ready. But then I see today that, oh, well, this get announced. This get announced. JC say, well, somebody else said, he said, I'm as for the culture. Like, nah, we're not doing that. 